Hey everybody, welcome back to the channel. JD here again. A short update, a um, couple of things. Um, I stopped at my local Michael's on my way home from work today. And uh, I found my blue flash I was looking for. So I was talking about the Barbados Rex painted and got like about four or five different colors off of this paint just by the base coat. Finally found it to go with my purple flash. And I also found some colors for the exterior of uh, the small scale group build uh, Bluebird that I wanted to paint. Um, the first one I found is Sea Breeze. I think this is a flat, but it's a very nice color. Um, it looks pretty nice. That's one choice. I actually bought three different colors that I want to use for, uh, I was thinking about using for the, actually I could probably use one of the satin ones for the interior and then use the gloss. I found one gloss color, maybe use that for the exterior, but this color is called Native Turquoise. It's a craft smart acrylic. This is a flat. Very, very nice. Would probably match. I'll put a, a, a picture of the car that I'm using for reference up in a second here. And this one is called Laguna Green. It is a folk art glossy color, which I will probably use for the exterior of the car because it's pretty close. But I'll. Again, I will post a picture of uh, that I got from online. Um, I'll put that up, and I have found in went digging through my my paints. I got some Tamiya gloss white for the upper part of the body. I have uh, uh, flat white for the interior to go with. I found my my AK, uh, my chrome, and my black base, so I can paint the bumpers. Mix these up really good. And I was online uh, for my NASCAR group build. I asked on the Lucas C Facebook page, uh, I had some Tamiya X7 Gloss Red and some uh, Model Master Guards Red for the interior because the interior of his car is, was red, very red. And uh, Lucas C recommended that I use this because it's and it's, a, it's easier. He likes it better, and I like it better because it's an acrylic. I can spray it in the house, um, and I have a bottle of gloss black, and this is the black I used on my Model A that I sprayed with the airbrush. Um, I don't know how much is in here. I didn't use very much of it when I painted the Model A because I only did the fenders. Um, I'm hoping that after my friend comes and sets up the stereo. Um, I can, if he's not here too long, I can get to the hobby shop uh, here in Modesto and uh, see if I can't get some uh, some more paint. I think they have to me as it. Um, I also found some other colors for the uh, for the small scale group build because I know I used to have a 1980 um, 210. Uh, I can't remember what code it is. I don't know if it's a 310 or what it was. Um, but I remember, because um, I broke the rear end like twice, that it's not black. It's like a grayish color. And I think the engine, the oil the oil pan is kind of a grayish blue color. So I'm thinking about using this for that. And also, I found it unusual that, I'm not going to show it right now, but I'll show it on my my Monday stash update, but I found a model kit, and this this uh, this Michaels usually doesn't sell model kits. Um, I went in there a couple of times, and I thought it was interesting that the Michaels in Turlock, which is a smaller town, sold model kits, but the uh, Michaels in Modesto, the bigger town, didn't. They didn't have much in the way of paints and stuff or supplies. And they had a few model kits, but I ended up buying a um, a kit that I've never owned before. Um, I did find, uh, I have built this car, uh, the AMT version of it, but I have not built the monogram version. And this, I think is the same 
monogram kit that uh, Matt Inman's wife Heather built uh, that she that she took with her. I think they went to whatever that show big show is back east. But anyway, um, in the comments, let me know which one of these three colors you think is the best. I will, like I said, I will post a picture of the car that I have in the video, and you guys can tell me what you think, which one would be better from your point of view. But that's it. I shall hopefully, um, I'd like to work on, since I got some colors now, I'd like to at least do the the interior of the, uh, the Bluebird, get that painted. Uh, I still have some sanding to do on the body. Uh, I'm probably going to wet sand the primer, primer it again, and hopefully paint the body. Uh, here real soon and that should be almost done uh, I'm still working on the NASCAR group build. Uh, I want to um, put some of this together and um, Start getting it painted Because um, I've been having fun, but I've been at work and I don't have much time when I go to work or much mood to be Working on anything but building models. I was saying uh, Rusty Rotors Rick I said like you know the Building models is such a great stress reliever. And when I wasn't building models for a long time, for like this through, well, it was a long, long time, but work-related stress, I think, was building up because I didn't have an outlet for it. And this is like really helping me out. So anyway, I hope everybody has a great weekend. Happy Saturday. And uh, we will talk to you later. Bye-bye.